guys, we're almost there, and Matt Kosciuszko is right behind me. Even emus. How cool. Very cool. We found some kangaroos. Tell us all about it. Um, well, we just drove into this campsite and it's not very hard to find kangaroos here because we're here at about five o'clock because their feeding time is around five to six o'clock. Look at the ones over the back, pretend fighting. Yeah. They, look, look. Those kangaroos fighting, they would probably be in between being joeys and full grown, they would be practicing their fighting skills. They're practicing their fighting. Yeah. And this guy right here in the car park is keeping a close eye on us. Look, he's watching us. Say hello. You're on more fun with Noah. And these three here are keeping a very close eye on us too. Look. Kangaroos are generally pretty cautious animals. Yes, they are. So what else do we need to know about them? Um. They won't attack unless they feel trapped and cornered. But here, we're being very safe and we're giving them lots of room to spread out if they feel, um, if it feels unsafe. Like, look at that one. It feels a bit unsafe now, so it's got lots of room to yes. get away if it needs to. Yes. Even though we obviously are not going to hurt them. No. We just want to get a good look at them because yep. they're beautiful Australian animals. Why don't you see how close you can get before they decide to take a bit of space? It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I can't tell if that one has a pouch, that one. Yep, keep talking to us, tell us what you're doing.
Oh, a lot. He's standing up, keeping a close eye on you. He Can't won't come towards you, I don't think. He's just making sure that you're not going to come any closer. Yeah, I don't really want to go much closer than this log, much further, because it could feel unsafe and we want to make sure when always, every time, when we're looking or getting up close to an animal, we need to make sure that you and the animal feel safe. Yeah. Always. This one, see how he's standing up like that? I think he's letting us know how big he is. I think that's what that's about. He doesn't like me coming over, I don't think, because I'm a bit taller. So he's probably thinking, I don't, look, look, here he goes, he's off, he's had enough. He's like, nope, I'm not hanging around for this. And then the other yeah. two are like, well, if you're going, I'm going too. That one doesn't seem very scared. It's happy with its grass. Yeah. Oh, there goes one in the back. And there's some more over that other side we can have a look at in a minute. All right, we'll leave these guys alone and we'll go find some others, shall we? Mm -hmm. Hey guys, we are in a bit of like a caravan park and we came like a bit of a resort sort of thing and we came to find some kangaroos and you can see, as you can see, we found quite a few of them. We weren't actually expecting to find this many. Oh, we found way more than we expected, but haven't we? this is amazing. It's pretty cool. Too many to even count. There's like yeah. nearly a dozen just on that corner there. All those ones standing up, they're show Oh, look at those joeys fighting. They're yeah. practicing their fighting skills. Yeah. Um, all them standing up will probably be telling us to back off a little bit. Yes. Oh, look at its joey. It's following them up. Oh, they're on the move. They don't want much of us anymore. What we might do is we might just go this way a little bit. We won't. We don't walk too fast, but we'll just walk oh, in this direction. All of them are watching us as well. Yeah. We'll just walk in this direction and see kangaroos how quickly they amazing. move off. I Here we love go, look. Kangaroos. Look, I mean, there you go. You can see them all hopping, guys. There you go, across the road. <laughs> oh, and they're going on the pedestrian crossing as yeah, well. Yeah, it looks like it, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Now, these ones are thinking is it too late for us to cross the road? Are we being cut off? Or... Go on. Away you go, guys. Go on. Maybe just wait here. Hang on. Go. They're following each other. Here they go. This one's decided I'm out of here now too. And his two mates are looking at him, going, wait for us. Just, yeah. And, just yep, stay. I'm going to go too. That could have been a mother or just an older joey. Anyway, guys, kangaroos are very cautious animals. They like to make sure that they're safe. Um... They aren't very, what's the word? They aren't very, they don't have a very good sense of like defense when they're alone. They always like to stay together. And when we got too close, some of them were a bit too far away from the mob, as you will call a, a big group of kangaroos. Yeah, they wanted some more distance, didn't they? Yeah, definitely. But where are they now? But they're on this bit of a hill, just grazing. They're a bit calmer with us now. Um, but they're them. still curious to see to find out what we're doing. So yeah, but look how amazing it is. You don't really. How many do we think there is? Maybe. Oh, I'd say about. Fifty out in front of us. Fifty. I was gonna say like thirty to forty. Thirty or forty. Um, but no, you never really get to feel the personality and see how amazing kangaroos are until you get up close. And just saying, guys, these aren't owned kangaroos these are wild kangaroos yeah, these are not at a zoo these are all in the wild no, they? if they if this was like a zoo or something they would be a lot calmer with us yes. because they would be used to seeing people every day now look watch what happens as we get closer they'll all stand up they want to stand up and keep an eye on us and they'll stand up to threaten us say if you get any closer like Ooh. pretend that i think i can see the big male Noah, look right on the far left he's hunched over looking at us yeah i think that's the big male i don't know if it's the leader but it's definitely a male he's a big boy i wouldn't get much closer dad no i think it could be the leader it's standing its ground Yeah, don't get closer than that.
That could be the big leader. That big boy right there is keeping a close All of them are huddling us. around the big leader. Yeah. And the way they communicate is through grunts and snorts. If he says for them to go, they'll go. They are keeping a very close eye on us. Some of them over to the left are just done with it. They think that that's Wow, too much. look at that big boy in the middle standing up now. I think he's definitely the pack leader now. Look at him. Yep. I think we should go now, give them, them spa their space. It's so hard. Try to go a bit faster. Oh wow, Mr. Fast. Hey guys, this is Jackson, my friend from school, Hi. and today we're at the river. We just went on a hike, it was a pretty beautiful hike, and we got this river behind us. Um, later we might go try and jump on the rocks and see how far we can get, but um, I've worked with Jackson here, it's been really fun. So, yeah. Hey guys, we're going to go out for a bike ride. We're going to take you on one of the 
most beautiful bike rides we know of. Mm -hmm. Where is it? Um, in Jindabyne. Yeah, Lake Jindabyne. Mm -hmm. Should we go? Yep. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yep. yep. I'll I'll direct you with my voice if I need to. Go down the hill. I'll follow you a bit. I'll overtake you a bit. Yep, down to the left. Watch for cars. Down to the right. How far can you throw it? Uh, Pick a good size one. Yeah. Plant that left foot and follow through. Let's see. Oh, that was a good splash. Pretty far. Hey guys, we just went for a ride um, on our bikes and we're at Lake Jindabyne. Beautiful, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Look at that view. Yeah. What do you think? One of the prettiest rides in Australia, do you think? Probably. What else do you want to tell us about it? Um, it's the second time we've come for a bike ride, isn't it, on this yeah. track? Mm -hmm. um, it was a little different though because we just had to turn left to go on to like a different path. But yeah, um, we're enjoying our holiday and yeah, that's pretty much it. Very good. Look at that beautiful view. <laughs> do you love the view here? Mm-hmm. And we rode our bikes from all the way over, way over there in the corner, which is where we're staying, just to the left of that sunset. Aren't we, Noah? Yep. What animals did we see today? We saw a wombat on the side of the road. Yep. We saw, um, what else did we see? Emus? 
It, oh yeah, we saw two emus. And tomorrow we're gonna go and, and find some. Yeah. What? Kangaroos. Kangaroos. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Mm -hmm. What else? What else did you do today? Um, we went into Threadbar and I rode the toboggans. Yeah. The toboggans. Yep. The bobsled. Um. Yeah. Same. Same. Yeah. Very good. Yeah. Having a good holiday, aren't we? Yeah. Alright guys, hope you're enjoying the video, don't we? Mm -hmm. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, make sure you subscribe. What do you reckon? Yeah, definitely. And uh, leave us a like. Maybe put a comment on what kind of other videos you want Noah to make. Yeah, and maybe what's your, your favourite Australian animal? Yeah, put it in the comments. Maybe you love kangaroos, maybe you love wombats or something else. Put it in the comments and we do read them and we will reply, yeah. won't we? Mm -hmm. we, we might put a like towards your comment or maybe like a heart or something yeah. like that. Should we go finish our bike ride now? Yeah. Let's so. do it. See ya. Yeah. Keep walking. Yeah. You do weight training at school. Just because, um, Here we are, mm -hmm. we're in Threadbow, yep. next to Little Threadbow River. Mm -hmm. What have you been up to on your holidays? Um, well, we've been like chilling at the bunk bed and... Riding your bike? Riding your bike. Um, what else? What else? I think, well, we might do the toboggans today. Yep. And we're having lunch next to this beautiful little river. Mm -hmm. See ya. chairlift to go up to the top of, uh, well not to the top, to the start of the mountain. Ew! And who's that sitting next to you? That'll flip. Your sister Wivy. We're in Threadbow, we're going up the chairlift to climb Mount Kosciuszko. Well we decide, do we run at the start of the chairlift or at the end, if we find out. Yeah. <laughs> but if you if the whole thing fell Yes, you'd, you'd be in trouble. But that doesn't that's happen. Is that impossible for, to happen? Yeah, it won't happen. You know when your face doesn't look like it actually is in real life in photos? You want to do a group way? Yep. Okay, right now we're on the chairlift. We're ne nearly done-ish, sort of. Um, and there's bike riders below us, just um, riding on the track. Where and are we going to? Right we're at the top. going to climb the tallest mountain in Australia, Mount Kosciuszko. Woohoo!
Hey guys, we are on our way up to the top of Mount Kosciuszko. We've just come up the chairlift to Three Bow Top Station. It's a beautiful sunny day, as you can see, blue sky. Isn't it, Noah? We're gonna have a fun day? Yeah. All right, what do you reckon? Um, it's pretty cool out here. It's getting cold, but it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. Should we do it? Mm-hmm. Let's do Let's it. Let's go. Seems high, and this isn't even the top of the mountain. Okay guys, who do you think is going to make it first? Me or Dad up there? I think it's going to be me because Dad was struggling on the hill before. Oh, thanks. But I can hear you, you know. If we get um, a bunch of likes on this video and comments, we might do another big mountain. See you guys. Okay guys, we're about 1.67 kilometers up. We've still got a long way to go, but we're going strong so far and it's very hilly so far, but we're going to keep going. Ooh, Two air Ks. Is up here. I could Thin play music. Air and no. cold. Oh. How you going, Noah? You alright? Yep. I'm good. Is the cold oh, air getting in your lungs? Pardon? Is the cold air getting in your lungs? Uh yeah, it's pretty cold. Yeah. Um I think the main part that I'm cold at is probably my legs. Yeah. Good um, exercise, hey? Yeah, but we're going downhill now, so it's yeah. easier. We're gonna do it! Here they come. A little mountain climbers together. Show them the view! What a view, guys! Isn't that amazing? We're so high up now. We've gone about. Oh, it went off my watch. But we're about 3.60 something. We're not far from the top. Yeah, right there. That mountain back there is Kosciuszko. Let's keep going. Let's go. Hi. How was that hill? It, it was pretty good. Pretty good? Good puffing? It wasn't too hard. How did your dad go? Um, <laughs> he's struggling. <laughs> not very good. Easy for little fellas like you, made of <laughs> rubber. Mm -hmm. I'm still like having fun. Mm -hmm. Yep. We still got to go all the way up there, don't we? Yeah. There's it's it's Osco in the background. It's a long way, but we're doing good. We're doing good. Go, go for a run, you. Ah. There he goes. Ah. Climbing the mountain by himself. The man, the mountain. The man, the mountain. I don't want to be alone. Now that is beautiful. Hey guys, we're almost there and Mount Kosciuszko is right behind me. It's right over there. If you could see right there, it's right there. We're so close, so close. But look around, what a view. And down there, there's a little lake. We can do it, let's go. Okay, I will do it. Not now. Three hundred years. <laughs> That's filming, no. Pardon? Thank you. 
we made it. Mount Kosciuszko, the highest point in Australia. Woohoo! Woo. Alright, that's filming. Throw us my sandwich, would you please, Liv? Thanks. I'd love one, thanks. Grazie. There we go. What do you think of that, mate? Good. Good climb, hey? Yep. What do you got on your sandwich? I got ham, salami and cheese. Ham, salami and cheese. I've just got salami and cheese. Oh, this grass is nice and comfy. It's like a bed, except for the spiky bit that's going up my bum. Oh, that was good. <laughs> Tiring, but good. Mm. Good one, guys. Were you two racing at the end, you two? A little bit. Did he? <laughs> I wanted to be first up. <laughs> Leave, I think that path down there is where the Duke of Ed goes. I think they hiked the Charlotte's Pass across there. Look where it goes, right over the back there. That's a long hike. Did our school do that? Mm -hmm. <gasps> when? Not sure. He would like Duke of Ed. I reckon I would. You get the right stuff. Do you sleep overnight? Yeah. Sometimes they go for three or four days. How long was Emily's longest one, Liv? The longest one for four days. I reckon mm. me and Will would like doing that. I didn't feel like climbing it this morning when I wake up. Well, we're here now. That's mm -hmm. a beautiful view. So. Yeah. Last time I did this was when I was eight. Is it? Mm-hmm. Because we didn't do it last year. I don't know, there's nothing to say.